Photovoltaic, or PV cells, directly convert sunlight to electricity. Multiple cells are grouped within a structural frame to create a module. When more power is needed than a single module can provide, the modules are combined into groups, called arrays. The most common type of module is the flat plate, where multiple cells are encased in clear materials, often made of polymer, placed onto a substrate of metal, glass or plastic, and covered with transparent plastic or glass, all of which is placed within a structural frame. The second type of module is designed to concentrate the sunlight to improve the output of the PV cells. These are called concentrator PV systems. A concentrator system includes a lens to focus the light in addition to the cells and support mechanism. Modules are combined into arrays to obtain the desired power output at a specific location. The cheapest way of mounting the arrays is to use a fixed mount which does not allow the array to move. The downside to this is that the array will not be oriented to the sun to receive maximum sunlight as it moves throughout the day. The alternative is to build a tracking system. A tracking system moves the array throughout the day following the movement of the sun. Tracking systems may be one axis, which follow the sun's movement from east to west across a single day, or two axis, which track daily movement as well as the sun's movement north to south on a seasonal basis. Clearly, tracking systems increase output for the same number of cells, and two-axis systems increase output more than one-axis systems. But these advantages must be weighed against the additional upfront capital and ongoing maintenance costs of the more complex equipment. PV arrays may be distributed on individual buildings or centralized into a utility-scale power plant.